There we go. Oh yeah, I think I got a hybrid, guys. It's fighting like one. Yep, or white bass, one of the two. Oh yeah. Nice white bass, oh my. <sighs> Finally. I just gotta get keep them gar away, and it's not easy, I'm gonna tell you that right now. That is a big white bass, that's what it is. Really dark colored, almost completely gray. Hooked him upside that, that pointing down. Big white bass though, I'll tell you that. Fairly decent, he's probably 14 or 15. Not a bad white bass, guys. Not at all. Not bad, I'll take him all day. Definitely. Heck yeah, man. It's a good start anyway. I knew there'd be some down in there. Not bad. Not a hybrid, but it's a decent white bass. Alright. Take him to the car. The problem with this hole is when you catch a fish, you need to keep it. Or else you're throwing them back in and it spooks them. I've experienced it in the past and it is true in certain places. They have ways of detecting stress from other fish and other signals they give off. You do not want to put them back in this little tiny hole. And then Asian carp, obviously you throw them on the bank. So you ain't got to worry, but... Alright guys, big mouth buffalo. About two pounds. both in that might stay on i've lost two or three nice fish since i've gotten here one was a buffalo this is just a baby but it's a fish hey that other one wasn't no baby yeah this is definitely not that first fish i had i really don't even need the net for this guy All right. Oh. All right, guys. First both end of the day, a little two pounder. Small female. All right. Let's get some of these big ones I've been missing. There we go. Oh my. What a giant. Stay on this time. Yeah, I got a nice bow fin finally, guys. At least a seven or eight, I would think. Oh yeah. Pretty decent. Oh my God, I can't even see my crankbait at all. Nope, not good. And I did not do what I normally do. I usually take the back hook off. Oh yeah, he's 26, I would say. Around that. <clears throat> Pretty 
pretty big one. <clears throat> Got him. Hell yeah, guys. Now that's a bow fin. That is not a bad one either. Not a bad bow fin at all. Probably about 26, 27 maybe even. Not a bad fish. Hey, I turned my day around at the very end anyway. That's what it's all about, guys. There we go. Oh yeah, I got him. I got him. Oh, it's a big one. It's a big one. Not bad anyway. Oh my God, he's completely wrapped up in the line. How did that happen? Now he's unwrapped, I think. Oh my goodness. Guys, it's almost every couple of minutes I'm getting one. They're biting really good right in the evening like this. Oh, this is hard by yourself to net one of these things. I'm so used to having her help. Good God. Got him. It's another small one. He may go three pounds, and that's about it. But it's still a lot of fun, guys. What a blast. <laughs> All right, guys. Bowfin number three. About the size of the first one I caught. Just a little two and a half pounder maybe. Male this time. All right, let's get him back in. God, he got off. <laughs> Large mouth. Boy, they're really... Guys, I was just fishing at the wrong time of the day. I realize that now. This was just one of them days. It was an evening bite. Only. Not in the morning and not definitely not in the middle of the day. It was not that kind of day. If I would have known that, maybe I should have stayed where I was. I don't know. Not bad little bass. About a half pound, that's it. There we go. There we go. Oh yeah, the big boy, finally. Right when the mosquitoes started biting the shit out of me. Is when the fish started biting. Really good. Now that's the one I've been after right there. He's a fighter. Oh my goodness. 
this fish may save the day. He stays on here. Let him wear himself out. And it takes him a while. He's a big and he's mid 20s again. Biggest bowfin of the day, 27 inches. Yeah, see if I can get. The only thing you do got a prayer for some reason. All these bowfin today, their their teeth have been in. Here. See, they can make their teeth stick in or out, and they've all been in today. I don't know why. This one's barely. They're barely sticking out. Not enough. I want to grab it. But. Fish of the day, male, 27 inches, with a tail half missing. Yeah, if I, if I had every one I've had hooked, I would have had 30 by now. You eat them? No, not these, I don't. Another one, guys. About 25. 24, 25. Maybe, maybe not. Oh. Come here. Yeah, jumped right in. Thank you, bud. He's he committed suicide basically. <sighs> uh, stay still. Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Always wrapped up, man. Get unwrapped. What are you doing? Circles? Yeah, this is my last one, and I'm, I could keep catching them, but man. Hey, at least I turned my day around. Caught two fish all day long and caught about 10 in one hour and a half. I think it was just one of them days where they didn't bite till about 6 o'clock. got to be that bright overhead sun yep. they just weren't having it there we go oh my you're trying and I'm gonna head home after this no where do you think you're going all right guys about a 20 God. Oh my. <laughs> All right, guys, about 24 inch female. Not bad.
All right.